Good morning, everyone. I think, uh, again, thanks, Jeff, for inviting me over here. I think this is a, this is a perfect community that uh, as we start building the augmented reality for reapplications, as, a, as a, at the, uh, the remark, the sort of opening remark says, you know, does, are we looking for problems to, or are we actually uh, have a clear problem to seeking solutions? Of course, you know, hopefully I, I, over this kind of a short presentation, I show you that there are real problems and there's also a real solutions based on vision sensor. We care everyone here in this community. So yeah, my background is all about the vision and sensor. I have been working on AR before, if you want. Uh, uh, it's really, if you know interior surgical, we have this kind of goggles, stereoscopic view. You have the instrument, you, we, we did a lot of, when I was back there, I did a lot of instrument tracking and how to interact with surgeons, of course, but that's a long way, it's FDA. So I didn't know what the status now, but uh, no, this is probably my second company for AR. So I, I don't know how many people know Daiquiri. So I think I probably two parts I want to show a little bit of what Daiquiri, what are, are we up for, right? You can say Daiquiri is a design company. It's a hardware company. It's a tech company, software and soft, you know, algorithm. Uh, and everything, and also working with customer uh, closely. So it's, it's a whole ecosystem. So it's not, I have this magic uh, tech can solve everything, right? So we're not doing that. We do a step by step, uh, working together with all of you also here. So I think um, maybe I, one thing I want to do is I show you a short clip. Again, this is a, probably most of you know that we are working with Intel. This is a little bit short clip from uh, so Intel CES uh, presentation keynote, two brains. Uh, Brian from uh, Intel and Brian from uh, Daiquiri. This is on the on stage of say yes stage. I explain it'll be if you have any questions. So it's some of the typical computer vision sort of technology you can apply. Some are a little bit more, but. But this is the problem we're trying to solve, right? How do you actually using AR overlay on top of a real working scenario, how to help you uh, make it much easier, uh, simpler to operate? And your hands are free, right? So your hands are really doing some work at the same time. 